Hi, uh, this video I am going to tell about uh, the temperature control system uh, used in microprocessor. Let me go into this uh, video. Uh, first, I will tell about uh, what is temperature control system. So, the temperature control system means uh, it is one of the uh, one type of control system uh, that automatically controls the temperature of an object or an area. So, object may be uh, any object. Uh, area means uh, either it may be a room or uh, whatever size uh, you want to measure the temperature uh, that area we can call it as uh, uh, that uh, object or area so by using that by using this uh, temperature control system we are going to control the temperature of either of either of an object or an area so where we apply this uh, temperature control system is a uh, temperature control system normally applied in uh, uh, home appliances like air conditioners, refrigerators, geysers and uh, some, uh, some more home appliances also. Here the temperature is automatically adjusted as per the given input settings. Whatever input uh, uh, we are giving based on that uh, the temperature is automatically adjusted. So what we require actually, so in order to implement this temperature control system we need uh, uh, three main components uh, one is a temperature sensor second one it is a controller and the third one is a uh, cooling system and uh, this is a block diagram uh, in this block diagram uh, whatever uh, components uh, i told in the previous slide that are mentioned here so this one actually it is a lm35 temperature sensor this is an lm35 temperature sensor followed by lm358 it is an operational amplifier then this is a controller motor uh, driver uh, so here temperature sensor controller and a cooling system so for cooling system we have a fan is available so apart from that we have a lm35 temperature sensor then lm358 it is an operational amplifier then l293 d okay we will see uh, the explanation so as i told these are the required components uh, one LM35 temperature sensor is required, then one LM358 operational amplifier required, uh, then motor driver, so the motor driver L293 uh, IC and one 12 volt DC fan uh, to cool down the uh, temperature, then one 10 kilo ohms resistor, then one 5 kilo ohms potentiometer and one breadboard and connecting wires. We will see one by one uh, what is the uh, use of this uh, every component. First one it uh, is uh, LM35 temperature sensor. The purpose of this sensor is uh, it is a Celsius scale temperature sensor device uh, with its output directly proportional to the temperature. So what it measures is it measures the temperature. Uh, it ranges from 550C to 1500C and uh, so here what is the uh, purpose of this uh, temperature sensor in this project is uh, it is used to measure the temperature of its surroundings and send the corresponding voltage values to the controller either uh, it may be temperature of its surrounding or temperature of its uh, area so we are using this lm35 sensor to measure the temperature of, a, of its surroundings and whatever temperature it is measured it sends the corresponding voltage value to the controller that is operational amplifier uh, the next component is operational amplifier so the chip number is uh, lm358 and uh, so this uh, ic actually operational amplifier consisting of two independent operational amplifiers and uh, so it can be used in a wide range of applications uh, where we apply this operational amplifier so we can apply in filters LEDs, lamp drivers, pulse generator, uh, then voltage controlled oscillator, amplifier. So like this we can uh, use this operational amplifier in uh, various applications. And here uh, we are using this uh, LM358 operational amplifier IC in its comparator mode. So it is used for comparing the desired temperature and the actual temperature. Next thing, uh, this is a circuit design. Uh, so LM35 actually, this is a temperature sensor. So that LM35 uh, contains uh, three pins. Uh, what are the pins uh, we have is a VCC. So VCC denotes for power supply, then data and ground signal. So these are the three signals available uh, in LM35 temperature sensor. 
so here the vcc actually it is connected to plus 12 volt power supply and uh, ground is connected to ground and uh, it forms a voltage divider with a data pin and a 10 kilo ohms resistor so here the output of the voltage divider is uh, given to the non inverting input uh, pin of the operational amplifier so whatever output uh, we get from this voltage divider so that will be given to the non inverting input pin of the operational amplifier go to the circuit diagram again so this is a circuit diagram so here as i told this is a lm35 temperature sensor it contains uh, three signals data so data then vcc then ground so data uh, vcc actually it is connected to plus 12 volt power supply then ground actually ground is grounded and data here we are forming the voltage divider so this will be connected to non inverting input uh, that uh, non inverting input pin of the operational amplifier lm358 come to the next slide then we have a, a potentiometer what is the purpose of this potentiometer is it is connected to the inverting input of the operational amplifier so the pin number 4 and pin number 8 these are connected to 12 volt power supply and ground so the pin number 1 actually it is connected to 1a pin which is the first driver input of the motor driver so in motor driver we have uh, so many driver uh, inputs are there so the pin number 1 actually it is connected to 1a uh, pin that is pin number 3 uh, that is the first driver input of the motor driver then second driver input that is uh, pin number 7 it is connected to ground pin number y 1 pin number 8 and pin number 16 these are pin number 1 is enable and uh, it is a power supply signal pin number 8 and pin number 16 is vcc2 okay Th these are connected to 12 volt power supply pin number 4 5 12 13 are connected to ground and uh, here the motor actually the dc fan it is connected between pin number 3 and pin number 6 that is 1y and 2y so we will come to the diagram again this is a this is a diagram actually so here the, this is a enable pin and uh, pin number 16 it is a power supply it is connected to plus 12 volt again pin number 8 it is also power supply it is connected to uh, plus 12 volt power supply pin number 12 13 it is a ground signal and 4 5 it is also a ground signal and uh, this uh, fan actually fan is connected between pin number 3 and uh, pin number 6 pin number 3 is 1y and pin number 6 is also 2y so it is connected between uh, pin number 3 and pin number 6 now we will come to the uh, working of this uh, temperature control system project actually uh, it can be explained easily by comparing it with comparing it with a closed loop control system this is a diagram actually uh, for closed loop control system uh, here again the components we have is uh, input uh, we are inputting the desired dryness to the controller uh, then followed by heating elements heating elements will heat the glass then we will get the actual dryness so the actual dryness again it will be given to the sensor if there is any error means again uh, that will be passed on to the controller this is actually the feedback loop now come to the uh, explanation here as i told the closed loop control system it consisting of input then a control device output and feedback in our temperature control system uh, input uh, Uh, that is temper input is a desired temperature then followed by control device that is a controller output output means uh, actual output then followed by feedback so here actually what is uh, our input is input is typically a sensor that continuously monitors the test parameter what is the parameter we are going to measure is it is a temperature and uh, here the input what is the input uh, here is lm35 temperature sensor and uh, the parameter what uh, we are going to measure is it is a temperature and uh, here the data from the input is given to the control device that is a controller uh, this control device will actuate the output according to the input signals and uh, in this project uh, 
so lm35 what is the controller we are using is lm358 operation amplifier and uh, as i have mentioned in the uh, previous slide it act it is uh, working in comparator mode and uh, here uh, we are comparing the desired temperature and actual temperature if the temperature is more than the desired temperature we need to activate the fan so we need to adjust the potentiometer uh, such that if the temperature increases above the value the output from the operational amplifier should be high so this high output from the operational amplifier it is given to the motor driver along with the fan it forms the output part of the control system and uh, since the other drive input of the motor driver is already connected to ground whenever the output from the operational amplifier is high then input to the L293D is high so the fan starts rotating and uh, it will cool down uh, this will cool down the surroundings and this phenomena act as a feedback in the control system so whenever the temperature decreases the LM35 sensor uh, senses it and signals the amplifier uh, that is operational amplifier to turn off the fan uh, that's all about uh, this topic uh, thank you for listening if you have not subscribed this channel uh, subscribe it thank you